ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ for 20 year i been working to telling my brother's story each year all my family friend we get together here and celebrating his life and his legacy together remembering him this year i feel like is special because today we have a community leadership elected office officer and family and friend get together and celebrating not only my brother life i think we celebrating all the victim of 911 and all the victim of hate crimes victim today and i think that's the best way to honor my brother legacy and all the family of the hate crime victims and the 911 victims to get together and and show the unity and the love to each other have a better community today you help me to remember what i learned in last 20 year from from all of you the love unity togetherness and that's the only way we can combat the hate and i had a hope i had a dream we going to have a this world will be hate free one day and with with your help with our new generation help i think everything is possible and i hope my dream will be succeed in one day I remember two day before my brother death and he want to have a press conference to educate other people about sick about the turban about the beard and two day later he was taken away from my family taken away from our community but I feel like his life his death is become a beacon of light to awareness that's the way i i feel like you know his life touch his his death touch so many people and i feel like i be uh he give me the job to be done in in my life to educate more people and save the innocent life that's the way i feel it and he give give to me because when we are sitting with uh, in our temple two day before his death in the meeting and he want to save the innocent people to protect the innocent people with the hate and today i would like to uh so much thankful to special city of mesa and the 20 year back mayor kino hacker and the community in local they open their arm and open their heart and today mayor come the city council come and is show us and we see is give the brighter future with the support from the local community leadership and all the national and the white house erica come to give the message from the joe biden our president is and and the our local governor doug dusi that's amazing and those kind of love and support make myself make my family make my community be proud be standing here today with you after 20 year and 
at the end, I think if we all today committed to each other how we can love, understand, respect your neighbor, we can make this, this neighborhood, this country, and this world hate free. I think the love has so much power. The Valdry talked about revolutionary love. I think if everybody understand that, and this world is going to be look like a heaven though. The heaven is here with us, but there are a lot of ignorance in our community, in our own people. We can educate through love to understanding and respecting to each other. At the end, I would like to thank you again from bottom of my heart, all of you to come and join, and especially this event uh, is, is uh, really touched my heart. It's not possible without the seclusion leadership and all their volunteer. It's head of, I have so much love. You done this event amazingly, amazingly done that. And I would like to thank you, all the media, without you, I think our message, our love, can reach the people who are ignorant through you. And I hope in, in this world, in this nation, nobody can lose loved one with hate. It's very, very painful. At the end, I would like to Phoenix Boycotcher to come at performance their songs. And after that, I would like to invite all of you to follow the, my family to be to the memorial to put the candle and flower to there. After that, I, I humbly request everyone to be share the meal with my family, with my Sikh community, to be at the end of that program. We have Indian food and we have a pizza there if somebody wants to have a different, not Indian food. And I really, really appreciate Please don't go without eat. And thank you so much again to come and join us.